Man, as a Louisville fan, it was so hard trying to get tickets to the Louisville Kentucky game. I know it happens every year, but it's so hard to get tickets. It should not be that hard to get a ticket to support your team and be a true fan. And with game time, that problem is no longer an issue. Uh, you shouldn't have to worry about buying tickets to your next big event. Game time is the fastest, easy way to get your tickets to the next big event and the price is guaranteed. So go ahead and take the guesswork out of buying tickets with game time. So download the game time at make account, use promo code club520 and get $20 off. Sign up. And while you at it, go ahead and use the promo code CLUB520 for $20 off your first purchase on the app. Don't forget, use CLUB520 for the promo code. You get that $20 off. Download game time today. Last minute tickets, lowest price guaranteed. Subscribe to our YouTube, CLUB520. Uh, we clowning on that mother. Just hit the button. <laughs> God. Don't ask more questions. Subscribe. <laughs> All right, we back. Another episode of Club 520 Podcast. I'm the host. My name is DJ Wells. Same gang with me. To my left, my dog, Bishop B. Hen, out the prairies. How you what, Nasty? Cool and nasty. Let's pod, baby. I want to say shout out to my Monty over at Melly. Jeff rocking the hoodie today. Yeah. Appreciate you for hooking the gang up, man, with the gear, man. Thanks. For sure. Appreciate the love. Uh, also, you got you got to pay the fine. You got a uniform, you know what I'm saying? Shout out to Yeezy. It's Sunday, so you get half yeah, a credit. Yeah, man. This is just for my dropping them bars over the weekend, man. That's it. Uh, Go on, introduce that other nigga, though. <laughs> to my right, my dog, Young Nacho, Young Tig. How you what, man? The realest. Uh, <laughs> I'm chilling, bro. Hey, these was really by my by the door. I swear to God, because I don't wore these already. I was showing a little nigga that uh, spent the night over the crib uh, with Orion. His little homeboy was there. He was, I was giving him a little tutorial about sneakers, and then I was telling him about Dornbecker. So these was really by the door. I wasn't supposed to wear these today. I was still on my seven wave, but it was hot outside. And I was repping for my my favorite team, the Bean. Oh, Boston. Wow. <laughs> Going to the chip this year. JT, we back. You already know. Going to the chip. They was doubting us, but we back. <laughs> Nigga, who was doubting the Celtics? <laughs> I don't know who was doubting us, but we back. There's a lot of hate we lost in Miami at home. Mm. Everybody was talking. That's true. Man, that's Buckles Glenn Davis tea. Shit. <laughs> that's Glenn Davis tea? Yeah, nah, that's the real. It's the real <laughs> bean tea. This is when I was there. We had that's championship, from we had championship aspirations when I was there. <laughs> GD, here's something to that. <laughs> <laughs> to my Rondo, that practice jersey? <laughs> Rondo gave me this shirt, bro. Oh, oh fuck out of here. Do gave me this shirt, you bro. You had cap ass, no. <laughs> Do gave me this shirt. Oh, man, we got to get to it, man. NBA playoffs have been absolutely crazy. You know what? I want to take – I want to apologize. I was wrong on the show. I don't, I don't like to apologize a lot. I don't like to well, say I'm wrong a lot. You know what I'm saying? But I owe y'all this. You feel me? I said Pacers in six. It's really Pacers in five. I apologize. Sorry, I guys. That. I didn't give out good insight. I didn't know that they was going to be Christmas like that. That's true. I feel that. They, they played good, man. They beat the, D, uh, the G League team. No. <laughs> Facts. Niggas just beat the fuck up, bro. And hey, guess what? But take y'all wins and, you know, keep it moving. Dang, please get well. Definitely get well. Facts. I don't give a fuck. We beat them in the regular season with both of them niggas. Mm -hmm. We beat them without them. It doesn't matter. Pacers in five. I ain't gonna lie. I, I was, I've been a Pacer fan my whole life. I played for the Pacers, so Pacers in five, man. Let's turn up. Let's do this shit. <laughs> let's go, let's T. Let's do this shit, bro. Hey, what's up, nigga? Where you from? I'm bringing my fuck, 44 fuck jersey them back out. Mario, yo, cap ass. <laughs> cap ass, nigga. I saw that shit. <laughs> oh, bro, they such and such shit. We ain't gonna add them, though. Nigga, fuck you. <laughs> you talking about Mario? <laughs> yeah. Shout out to my boy, Miles Turner, boy. He been getting, now he getting all that love from y'all, Indianapolis boy. I've been, been no told y'all he was like that. Hey, I ain't going to hold you. Miles, Miles has been playing phenomenal this series. The second half of the season, for sure, but Miles has went crazy this series. He's been playing real good. Got to sure. gotta respect it. Told y'all that, man. That's my young boy. He's been always... Hey, I ain't going to hold you. That game three was really one of the crazier basketball games I watched in a very long time. Crazy from a standpoint that Rick was really getting out coached by Doc Rivers, and it really, like, I didn't know how to feel. Was he really, though? Absolutely. How? Absolutely. Um... Doc Rivers was like made a minor adjustment, and I saw Rick Carlisle say, "Nah, fuck that. We still gonna do that." I'm like, "Damn, you get our coach by Doc, bro. That is nasty." Not fouling up three. I want to ask you to, both of y'all, basketball savants, he, coach. He is supposed do you to foul three. Uh, what's his name? Nimhar was supposed to foul uh Chris Middleton. 
So he wouldn't hit that first three? What? I don't understand why that's even really a question. They like, unless to. your team can't hit free throws at all, why are you not fouling up three? Yeah, he is supposed to. He is supposed to foul. That's just smart. Uh, that's one Miles Turner was supposed to foul. Well, uh, he got hung up. Yeah, on yeah, the second screen. Yeah, yeah, he was supposed to foul. He was supposed to foul. But just the fact that we just didn't was crazy to me. I'm like, why is that not a thought? I think that I don't understand how that doesn't happen more often. Yeah, um, and Chris Milton played the best game I've ever seen him play in his life. That nigga's nah. cold. I'm never disrespected. I know he fuck around and be a Hall of Famer, bro. Chris yeah. Milton did not have to go Super Saiyan on us like that. I seen him play better. Played Atlanta Game Six, where he went to win the championship. He killed Game Six. He did to close that shit out. He was going crazy. <clears throat> That's the game you was hooping in too, right? Yeah, you know. <laughs> <laughs> Bucks and seven. Oh, my fucking Hey, man. Bucks and seven. Hey, man. <laughs> Dang, get healthy. Bucks and seven. Fuck they talk about. Dang, please get healthy for next year. That? That's when we was in the finals. Bucks Fuck the seven. deer. I found this shit in my garage. Bambi That's legs. <laughs> nigga, Bambi. Bambi legs. Fuck Only the real deer. number five they got. Don't know, they will retire my jersey. Nobody wear five this year. It's not right. I used to wear back in the day. <laughs> Bucks and seven, man. The real ticket. <laughs> <laughs> in your practice jersey <laughs> Bucks and right, seven Hey man Shout out to the Bucks man I think next year We probably see Giannis there I don't think we see Dame there next year Damn I don't think so man Fuck it Stay bro I, Why Why would he stay? Fuck it Get, get where, where you gotta where, go Where you gonna go? Where you wanna go? Where Miami. you gonna put it? Get where you wanna go brother You feel me? Go to Miami, brother. Go on to Miami. Yeah, I, ain't mad at that. I think it's a race of time. That. I think it's a race of time between him and Donovan. But who get there first? Ooh, yeah, they in a race. They definitely race to get there. But Orlando ain't gonna make it. Hey, Orlando. My boy's they, playing all right. They, they ain't found out something. That's why I said it's a race. It's who gonna lose first. Yeah. Uh, Damon and them. They going back. From the looks of it, look like Damon and them gonna lose first. But. For sure. But do you think? I don't know, man. I, I like Orlando, and I think they done figured out what they need to figure out. Yeah. Last year, Cleveland had the lowest rate of offense in the playoffs, and now they're getting right back there. Yeah, I think they, they just got that backcourt don't work. That front court, back court, none of it works. It's too many people. They got two, three bigs. I don't know <laughs> what they're doing. Jerry Allen, Mobley, then they play, they play random people. I don't know. I don't like they set up. But I feel like they got talented players, but like you said, they don't have like a fucking team. Nah. Like Darius Garland, nice. Donovan Mitchell, obviously, them both of them are nice, but they don't complement each other well, I guess you would say. No, nah, not at all. Evan Mobley need to go to a better team. I wouldn't <laughs> mind seeing Bradley Bill with Cleveland. Like trade Donovan Mitchell, and then they go get Bradley Bill. So you want the Phoenix Suns to trade another for another two guard? Nah, I'm saying like a three team trade. Like, oh, okay. Phoenix need to get a point guard. Phoenix, <clears throat> please get well soon. Yeah, Phoenix need to get a point guard. And that a, shit is crazy, bro. And another big wing defender, like, like a six eight six nine wing defender. You know, it's crazy. They traded all their assets, and. All the assets that they're looking for is something that they already had beforehand. I yeah. think they got too greedy. Yeah. Like, I understand getting KD is Kevin Durant. You got to make yeah. that trade. But you look at what they gave up from that championship roster outside of CP till now. It's like everything y'all wanted, you already had. Yeah, they had. They needed Michael Bridges and Cam. Come on, man. Johnson, they need them. They need one of them bad. And a point guard. Yeah. But they have all their money tied up into three some off. I mean, three shooting guards. Facts. Yeah, losing Markel hurt them for sure. It was a it was a bad put together team. Yeah, because they thought Book could play point. Book a score, man, and he needs somebody to set him up. He don't need that responsibility of trying to get other people involved. That's why Markel fit that team perfectly. Yeah, and especially when you look at Book's best cur- <clears throat> best seasons his career so far has been with Chris Paul. Yeah. Like, he obviously benefits from having a, suit, a good guard with him. They would be a totally different team with a point guard. For sure. But shit. Him and Bill the same player. For sure. Well, Bradley had a... Brad looked like a shell of himself right now. Because yeah. he's just not in his element. Like, Brad Cole. Absolutely. Average 30. Now to come there and be the third option and trying to figure it out. 
And it just ain't, it ain't a good fit for Brett. And they playing against a team. Yeah, they, they play. playing against a fucking team. Yeah, because Minnesota not bullshitting. Nah, they they legit. Anthony Edwards doing the DX is the funniest shit ever. Everybody's like, he the face of the league. The allegations is gone. We ain't talking yeah. about no more. And then he do the DX. I love I it. Fuck with it. You know how I feel. Remind me. Oh, nigga. We back. <laughs> oh <my> Minnie. <laughs> Minnie, take me back. <laughs> Listen, I lied. All that stuff I said about y'all, I really liked it there. Come back. Hey. Come on, man. Don't nobody wear a zero out there. I'm back. I'm a real Timberwolves fan. Come on, man. I'm about to sweep these boys. How many jerseys are there left? <laughs> I don't know. He played for a lot of teams. He can go crazy. They got Wait, got you didn't bring the Orlando jersey? I ain't play for them. <laughs> Briefly. <laughs> they waved me. Oh, damn. That's, hey, that's the first bad. time I got fired from a... Uh, that's the second time I got fired from a job. <laughs> I got fired from Myers, too. <laughs> but nah, man. You working at Myers longer than Orlando. <laughs> <laughs> I swear to God, I did. <laughs> but shout out to the Timberwolves, man. Y'all know, man. I love y'all. Love the fans out there. and Nothing but support. Shout out to the to A lot of y'all be DMing me like, man, we ain't hate y'all. We didn't everybody hate you, only a couple. I'll be like, it's all good. I love y'all. Oh no, nah, you ain't see the YouTube comments. They lying. <laughs> it's me and Steph, it's me and Stefan Marbury. <laughs> we the most we the most loved. That's crazy. And Bassy. Yeah, me, me, Bassy and Steph. And Bassy, nigga. Oh, Fuck man. it. Hey man, Timberwolves looking like they about to go crazy, but the, the biggest problem is they're gonna have to run to the nuggets, man. Yeah, I'm going to have my floor seat, though, so I ain't tripping, man. I'll be there for game one. Yeah, okay, see, I'm about to get my Pelicans up out of there. Oh, ah, yeah, that's ah, yeah, a that's... bad blend over there. That's another, they have to, CJ got a B.I. free, please free B.I. Yeah, they, please. B.I. need a new home. They yeah. need a point guard. They do, too. <laughs> what, what about Jose Alvarado? Oh, yeah. They need a point guard. My Shout bad. out to him. Um, <laughs> they need a point guard. I went but, back to Taco Bell. It ain't really that many point guards like available though. <laughs> Send them back to Taco Bell. It's crazy. crazy. That's not. But it ain't that it's many sad. point guards available though. Like it definitely ain't. Somebody gonna have to take D'Lo. The way you said that made it so bad. I'm but, saying like, well, my nigga was on the bench eating. And yeah, they had to cut him. I'm saying he gonna be a free agent, but. I mean, who else is a top point guard that's available? It's a very hard position to Drew fill. Drew Holiday got locked up. Drew got that bag. Yeah, Mike Conley just got the extension. Definitely. Yeah. Who else you going to sign? I ain't no... You got to go find one of these. That. And you're not getting it in the draft. Nah, you got to get one of these young diamonds in the rough that's on the bench. Let me think of somebody on the bench that... That's where that scout yeah, report come in. Yeah. Yeah. Who on Spartan. Detroit? Shit. Who on Charlotte? <laughs> Shit. Who on Memphis? Shit, Memphis. Jayden, get the fuck free, Jayden. God damn, get Jayden. Uh, Tyus Jones there. might be a popular. Tyus Jones is definitely a starter on a good team. Yeah, he, he just got caught popular. in the rapture. He gonna be a popular. Did they like Kobe mm-hmm. White up? Yeah, Kobe White just got a deal. Yeah, he ain't gonna work. Shout out to Kobe White. Fuck with you. Yeah. He should've got most improved. No disrespect to Tyrese, because obviously he had a phenomenal he season. Got he most should've got improved. most improved, bro. Yeah, definitely. Go, scoring 20 to 25 is obviously a jump, but it's a big difference with what Kobe White did. Yeah, because I thought Kobe White was... It was questions. Yeah, but now he, he didn't prove people wrong, man. He's nice. That's another team that's that's housing players that should be on another team. Zach Levine shouldn't be a bull. He won't be. And he definitely won't be. And DeMar DeRozan deserves not to be a bull either. I mean... Put my dog back on a good team, man. Just pay him, pay him man. Just, he won't pay the dog and trade him. Damn. That's how I feel. So he could spend his last year at least attempting to get a uh, trophy, for sure. What about what about my boy James Harden? Boy, he turned down the heads of time today, didn't he? James Harden looking like, the, clock. looking like the real James Harden. That boy is out there cooking. Well, the Clippers look good when Kawhi Leonard don't play, apparently. Yeah, that, I think it's, they throw their rhythm off, man, because there's so many. James ain't that aggressive when Kawhi play. But... Going forward, if they win this series, they're going to need Kawhi against whoever the hell they're going to play. Who they going to play? If okay, they win this series, yeah. Yeah, because <clears throat> OKC okay, a little smarter than, um, I ain't going to say smarter. 
I should say. They game plan a little different than um, Dallas. They play deep. Everybody on their team play defense. Mm-hmm. Luka don't play defense at all. Like, James Harden was walking by that boy hitting floaters. I'm like, God damn, bro. It's embarrassing, bro. Yeah, like, you good as fuck, bro. Try a little bit. Just hedge, a little bit, bro. Nigga. Hedge. <laughs> it's just a slow bar for bar. Ain't nothing wrong with a little hedge, bro. Bro. I'm six, seven. Just give me one of them. Try a <laughs> little, bro. Uh, I, like, just a little bit, bro. Nah, you don't give a fuck. And it's hilarious. They just walk by him, like. I'm like, damn. I told you, man. Clippers win the championship, bro. They ain't going to win a chip. No, but... Your Clippers are five. It's cooked, sir. Clippers win the championship. Nah. They fuck Ky- around knowing this. Kyrie's so nasty, bro. Bro, that lay- that layup finish that he had today is probably is one of the best I've ever seen Kyrie, from him, bro. Kyrie Cole. Yeah, that's bro. definitely in his top tier highlight bag. Bro, he finished I mean, it was three? all three people, bro. Bro, he... That is crazy. I, I still remember the highlight. <laughs> he hit a layup against us. I mean, when I was on the Wolves. Shout out to my boy A.E., bro. We about to take this shit over. I'm back. Is Zero retired Wolves family? <laughs> <laughs> this motherfucker jersey so motherfucking tight. I had to be 185. I tried to put this bitch on earlier. I had to be 185 and this motherfucker. I'm 210 now. Just run up on me if you want. But I probably 185 when I was wearing this motherfucker. This motherfucker tight in the That's bit. That's crazy. And now you talking about that highlight. You talking about the step through when he hit the... Yeah, he hit the layup that he pointed at all of us. Yeah. I said... Oh, bitch, I could jump. <laughs> <laughs> but I fuck with cop, man. He cold, bro. Man, what's crazy is they almost came back today. Nah, because of him. He cold, bro. <laughs> they really lost. Let me stop. Because I love Luca. I think he cold, too. But they lost because of Luca. Hmm. He didn't give them nothing to close that game out. He don't play no defense, bro. Like, a nigga don't try. That nigga James Harden walked by that nigga. Shot... Six of these in the fourth quarter. That nigga was shooting a floater. Like, he <laughs> cold, but nigga, he was just walking by. I'm like, this shit is crazy. What's crazy is he be looking for the outlet before he, niggas even done shooting. I'm like, damn, yes. nigga. <laughs> Open runs, bro. I swear to God, I'm like, just, he just try a little bit, bro. I swear to God, they win that game. But what I love about that series is that all the people we like that can hoop, they just hooping. Yeah. Like, I was not saying I'm happy he won't play, but... You talk about James Harden not being aggressive when Kawhi out there. PG does the same shit, too. Yeah, yeah, facts. Because we look at how he was game three to game four, totally different. He was going crazy. But they just out there hooping. Yeah, that's facts. why I fuck with that series the most. Yeah, yeah, that's facts. PG was, he was nasty in the first half. Second half, not too much. He had a big shot at the end of the game, but that three-pointer, that step-back three-pointer, that was tough. But, uh... Yeah, man. That shit, that's, that's a good series. That's probably the best one. Nah, fuck that. The Knicks got the best series. Joel and B and Kyle Lowry should not be on the same team ever again in life, bro. That's flopping shit right it's there. It's disgusting, bro. Yeah, they be flopping. I but, hate it. That shit lame. I hate it. And Joel and B so cold, bro. All right, this, the real question is, we used to have a debate about Jalen Brunson and Tyrese Halliburton. It's Jalen Brunson. It's not even a debate no more. Why? Because he almost had 50 and 10. Come on, bro. He is different, bro. He leading the Knicks, bro. He is leading the Knicks. Nigga, they about to beat Philly, the reigning, the MVP. Niggas is playing on Philly, too. On Philly, too. They healthy, yeah. DJ. Tyrese, he going against Tyrese Maxey. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Getting 50, 10. <clears throat> and he got the Knicks up 3-1. Y'all going against the niggas on minimum. Respect, though. No. Get y'all wins, King. First of all, we're going we're gonna to be respectful because Tyrese had a, tri- a nasty triple-double. 18, 16, They 10. lose the game of Dame on strain his Achilles. Well, Bobby Portis get kicked out. That's Bobby. Bobby, come on. Not in the clutch, bro. Don't do that. Yeah, that was... That hey, was, listen. Yeah, Nimby, I feel you, but guess what? The last person he punched, he went overseas. <laughs> Chill out. <laughs> Marriage is still don't talk right. <laughs> No, man, I got to be for a nigga sock you out I don't even want to say any Spanish, though. I just want to make sure. Well, he changed that from this. He's after that motherfucker hate maker. <laughs> what, he go India? <laughs> that nigga, that nigga start India. speaking Latin. <laughs> <laughs> he on a different national fun. team after that push, that boy. That boy turned into a Latin, boy. <laughs> I see that. I said, hey, yo, I'm, I'm geek too, but chill out, bro. <laughs> James can't get down the court that fast. Yeah. Uh, back on topic, though. Jalen Brunson and Tyrese Halliburton, what y'all doing? I think that Jalen Brunson is obviously a much better scorer than Tyrese, but I feel like from a 
standpoint of how he, they fucking adjust with the game or how they dictate the game, I'm still going with Tyrese. Because that's the next matchup, right? I did. Uh, I think so. I think, no, because I think, yeah, it's, that's it how is. it should be. We should be playing the Knicks. Yeah, I play the Knicks because if y'all win, because everybody hurt from Milwaukee. The Knicks versus. I heard your little preference. We beat them already in regular season the with Knicks. both of them. I don't, I don't, I didn't want to win this way, but <laughs> sorry. Knicks this versus, had to happen. <laughs> Knicks versus Pacers. I got, Pacers. I got Jalen Brunson cooking, y'all. Facts. Because uh, we already see Tyrese Halliburton hedging on motherfucking dang. Oh, well, he's definitely not guarding Jalen Brunson. No, no, Jalen Brunson. <laughs> Nimhar, Nimhar can't guard him. Jalen Brunson got too much shit. Like, no, nah, he can't. And that, he shoot 30. He getting 30 attempts up. He don't give a fuck. Hey, him getting what? That on how many shots did he have? 34? Yeah. 48 on 34 is crazy. Yeah. Kelly Oubre was hating him for that, though, for saying yeah. that. You can't say it when he was killing you. That's, yeah. that's hate. Fuck it. But I feel him, though. Like, nigga, you should score 48. You shoot 34 times. See, but, hey, when Kobe said it, yeah, the, it's all cool. But when everybody else do it, it's a problem. Yeah. <laughs> Fuck it. He got 48. I can't get mad however he got it. But nah, we played them in the regular season, and we we handled them just fine. Yeah. They don't I have. They don't put no fear in my heart. Yeah, they should. They're going to cancel each other out. And they tougher than y'all. I mean, oh, maybe. OG, yes. you see OG guard and motherfucking mm -hmm. Joel and B today? He don't give a fuck. Yeah, you think we... he going to guard? He going to lock Pascal shit up. Oh. They can lock oh. Joel and B up? Oh. Man, I'm broke. That's his man, so you know he know his game front to back, so shit, he might. I saw what Pascal did. I'm not, I'm not <laughs> worried. That's crazy. What I'm saying? Yeah, he's front. <laughs> He know his game front and back is crazy. Come on, bro. You gotta go up, bro. Come on, bro. You know I'm all for the hoes, bro. <laughs> that hit, he got him back in different. All right, man. Chill, we bro. the game with the basketball spiel, man. What's that, man? Without a ball, it's just a court. Without your spirit, it's only a game. So together with the fans, we bring our best. Hennessy is excited to celebrate the intersection of basketball with art, music, and fashion. Each of these elements of culture represent ways that fans, players, supporters pay homage to the game, both on and off the court. Hennessy and Mitchell and us have come together for the ultimate drop, a limited edition collection to mark their shared love for basketball culture and to celebrate Hennessy's continued partnership with the league. The exclusive collection will have a limited drop available for both in retail and online and will be featured on the Hennessy Arena Tour, making stops in San Francisco, Saturday, March 9th, Dallas, Sunday, March 17th, Atlanta, Saturday, March 30th. Come see Club 520 Podcast taped live in each city. For your next pregame, let's share a twist on the classic, the Hennessy Margarita. A squeeze of fresh lime juice. And a bit of agave syrup. Top it off with some ice and a salsa rim. Mix it, shake it, pour. And enjoy the spirit of the NBA. Hennessy. Without your spirit, it's only a game. 21 and over only. Please drink responsibly. Shout out to Reggie Bush. Got the Heisman back. That's crazy, man. Gotta do all of this, bro. Niggas been getting I paid. I wouldn't even all want that motherfucker NIL back. All because NIL became, exactly. All because NIL became cool. That money didn't make that nigga fucking run like booby mouths, bro. Like, I don't understand how that, like, equates to a nigga's game on the field. Like, I just, I never understood that. It wasn't an amateur. He got paid to play. A lot of people did. Yeah, he yeah, wasn't the first one. Uh, me too. It's crazy. <laughs> A lot of motherfuckers though, bro. OJ, they deserve OJ it, bro. Mayo, everybody got paid to goddamn mm -hmm. go to their respective places. Niggas just want to go on the USC off the strength. Want to go on the USC for the the lineage. He probably even get paid for real for like he was worth. Shit. He was definitely underpaid, bro. bro what that nigga probably was worth twenty million in college. He was one of the most exciting players to ever play football, especially he, college football. He's definitely the most exciting player to ever <clears> play college football <throat> by far. Easily, bro. We talk about the legendary Max Preps mixtape all the time, bro. Yeah. He's the reason why I found out about All Purpose Yards, bro. <laughs> Swear to God, bro. Not real shit. I yeah. didn't know about All Purpose Yards to Reggie. He had 700, bro. what, in a game or something like that? Or the 500? <laughs> Five, seven, a thousand. All I think he had 500 retarded. All Purpose Yards. He did. In the game. Definitely he did. did. Yeah, that shit's crazy. Damn, bro. Why did he ladder him? He's the greatest college running back. Because he era. could do He's anything he that. wanted in college, bro. He was like having fun. That nigga was playing Madden in college. Like, throw that. I'm a lateral, but fuck it. We that Damn. good. Look, like, fuck it. I'm better. He did now. the same shit today. I think he went to De La Soul. He went to. Did... You said De La yeah. Soul? Yeah, 500 yeah, total yards. I think that's the name of his high school. Was it Cali? Maybe Fresno I'm wrong. State. Yeah, that was a legendary game. Yeah. What was it, 525? 513. 513. Uh. That's crazy, bro. Niggas. Is One nigga, bro. That's crazy, bro. Elite, bro. 
That's fucking nuts, bro. He was silly in the pros, so he just got hurt a lot. I mean, yeah. I mean, he had injuries, but he was still. <laughs> nah, he was him. Nah, he's, he's, he's the injuries got the best of him, though, nigga. He had been better player right now in this, like, this era of football because he was a better, like, he could catch. Dog, he would have been. He'd been like Christian, whatever. I was going to say, he'd have been Christian McCaffrey. Yeah. Nah, facts. Yeah, see, I don't know if you and EJ have been had nothing for him, bro. Right now. It was like, yeah. Yeah, he, he would have touched them laces. <laughs> oh, them laces would have been crossed for sure. I ain't going to do my thing. Especially when you was at Syracuse. <laughs> Ugly. <laughs> Damn. Hey, we ain't doing my nigga Z like that. Nah, shout out to Z. I see my boy announcing one of the coach picks. That shit was tight. Uh, yeah. Presidential Z. Hey, you're going to be around a lot. Yeah, time, on God, bro. But they need to, uh, the Charles family need to sue the NFL. <laughs> For real, bro. They did my nigga bogus as fuck, bro. I understand what they were trying to do. It didn't come off right, bro. No, it, not in the social media era, bro. No, bro. No, no, bro. no. They didn't set him up to be successful. Yeah. I understand what they were trying to do, but no. No, bro. No. They had my nigga doing Google Gaga up there, yeah, bro. bro. No. <laughs> Shit went cool, bro. No, man. The I first, ain't laughing, the bro. First, the first, I was, I was like, yeah, I gotta send it to these niggas. Nah, that shit fucked up. The bro. first part, bro, he out of pocket. <laughs> that don't have nothing to do with the NFL. <laughs> Yeah, dude, The man. name, understandable. <laughs> what he say at first? What? What's the What's the team, y'all? What is what's the team? Well, that nigga ain't say Chiefs, right? I was like, nigga, you play for them. Like, hold on, nigga. But, uh... Luis. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. Yes. Yes. No. Yes. No. No. For sure. No. Yes. No. They're gonna. <laughs> no. 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 Why? <laughs> Bro. That's already out there, bro. He did that on national TV. No, but he got a problem, though. Yes. He went to school. Like, he grew up, like, going to, he grew like, up what? going to the he was other class. Yeah. Y'all making that up? No, we're not. Guy. No, he really did. He was in Chewy class. Yeah. So why is he announcing shit? Because it was like to it was a, that's yeah. like That's like... He, he's like, I has a whole foundation about it. Youth Matters Family Foundation. Oh, nigga, that's for niggas who ain't got daddies. Nigga, <laughs> <laughs> that ain't no. The fuck? That's every nigga we grew up with. <laughs> oh. What type of scholarship do they have? <laughs> hey, my fucking... <laughs> Back Listen, to school, D1 it, factory. It don't say nothing about no damn learning disability. <laughs> right. Yeah. Fuck out of here. These niggas is cat. Impacting activities for youth and local communities. Luis. These niggas is cap. If it was yeah, it established, I'm telling, you, I'm telling you what it said, man. Was it established pre 2020? <laughs> hey, did y'all see when Amanda Seals said she, she had autism and then we found out that she self diagnosed herself with autism? <laughs> she said she wasn't going to the doctor. <laughs> I said, bitch. You cannot do you that. Out of pocket. Hey, also, get well soon to Shannon. Because when she said she experienced racism as a kid and he said, but you weren't an adult. That is the craziest <laughs> shit I have ever seen in an interview. That passed anything that happened to that Cat Williams interview, bro. Shannon told that bitch, you trying to role play? But you ever diagnose yourself with autism? Man. <laughs> you cannot self-diagnose yourself. That nigga was so uncomfortable with her hollering at him. Facts. I said, damn, nigga. She throwing... You don't want it. Okay. Respect. That ain't his lineage. Yeah, right. that's nah. respect. It's just a flashback to him getting out the sprinter. Yeah, yeah, I said respect. <laughs> respect, Salute. bro. Respect. Hey, but speaking to USC, uh, DJ Wagner might go there to play with Juju. Love who you love. DJ Wagner love want to play with Juju. <laughs> it's crazy. <laughs> you be DJ Wagner going to the same. Right. They go together. They go together? Allegedly, they're a couple. So people kept saying this the new the new loving basketball. Uh, he and I said, y'all got, y'all got DJ fucked up. He can't be Quincy McCall, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Sound about right. Yeah, niggas are disrespectful. <laughs> he going to play with Juju. That's crazy. <laughs> That's Juju school. I'm talking about buddy hopping out the car. <laughs> <laughs> I hope, I hope. They need to edit it to Bobby I, Brown I, I, in a Ja Rule video <laughs> when he hop out the helicopter. Fire video. My nigga was so coked out. Oh, nigga. One of the best videos I ever seen. Oh, for that sure. Motherfucker when, that nigga, when that nigga hit the foot slide, I, oh my God, nigga, with that motherfucker. That nigga had his hat like this, too. Anytime you wear your hat like this, you is fucked up. <laughs> 
Nigga. And he had the jersey, y'all. Nigga, what? Nigga, and I know y'all getting the ball. So that nigga's got activated. I said, that nigga is high. I oh, can't man. wait. Oh, man. <laughs> Murder Inc. <laughs> that nigga's a foul for that, nigga. Jaw out of pocket. Murder. That's what that nigga I was probably said. on that dust, too. Oh, for sure. For Jaw brother. That was on Molly. Oh, fuck. Oh, no, that was on X at that time. Nah, this is a pure coke <laughs> Shout out to Bobby Brown. Still got the, the best fried chicken recipe of all time. Facts. That nigga, that nigga cooked this chicken with a brick. It's crazy. Legendary. <laughs> that recipe would be available at the next Hendrix Experience. Lincoln Bio. Hell oh, God. No. That's the, the go package. The Bobby Brown cookbook. That's probably what took Whitney up out of here. Nope. <laughs> Sunday dinner? Nope. Her last nope, six nope, piece. Nope, nope, nope. <laughs> <laughs> nope, nope, nope. Yeah, you no. Go to Is that the five piece from the Eagle? Yeah. <laughs> you go to George, put that lemon pepper on that motherfucker. So it wasn't that same shit you put on your chicken. It was sort of never. The honey pack. <laughs> People are still talking to me about that double. And ass I know shit. y'all getting bored. <laughs> So damn y'all, I wasn't trying to get activated. Chill. I'm with the guy. Metro. <laughs> oh, oh, man, what is, what's next, man? Oh, oh, shit. Uh, the transfer portal has been crazy. Mm. Uh, Cal got all his recruits going to Arkansas. We've Shut seen up. that coming anyway. It's Shut just, up. I look every single day, and there's some random kid that averaged 15 at one school that's now in the portal. Wait, hold on. Is DJ's going there, too? No, it's no. between there and USC, but it's looking like it's going to be USC. Oh, okay, cool. cool Why cool. looking like USC? Because of Juju? Nah, I think just I think the relationship we got with the coach and probably the money situation uh, probably is going to be a little bit more dope, careful. Dope. I imagine. I think Isaiah's out of there, so. Yeah, cool. he left. Cool. And they rebuild. They got a new coach and everything. No, I like that. I like that for He him. should be premiered as a player. He's, yeah. yeah. Or Kansas going to be cap, uh, popping, though. Listen. It's about to be lit. Yeah, it's going to be nice in Arkansas. He got all his kids he was going to get. Got the transfers. They got the money. They got the bucks. They definitely got the money. They about to turn that shit up. Yeah, I'm excited to see what he's going to do, man. I ain't going to lie to y'all. Jaggers got top five lemonade, bro. Jaggers, strawberry lemonade, gun smoke. Hey, shout out to my boy from Texas Roadhouse. Y'all know I'm a fucking frequent flyer in there. I appreciate the love in there, homie. It was, that was that was love, bro. I got some gift cards for y'all, too, for some Texas Roadhouse. Y'all don't need it because y'all don't go like I do. I'm a real supporter of Texas Roadhouse, bro. I'll be back in there tomorrow. Uh, if y'all want to give me some more free food, Oh, it's crazy. I don't mind. Just what run you, the gift card, my nigga. You don't have to say all that extra cap ass shit. <laughs> Be here. What do you order? I don't know. Probably a bad bitch salad <laughs> with the ranch on it. <laughs> no, you know eat ranch. They don't eat nothing white. You don't eat nothing white. You get you get French. Yeah, for sure. You're French nigga. Respect. Yeah, sure, hey, sure. I ain't gonna hold you. <laughs> I laugh so hard about you getting denied your dressings. Oh, they yeah, really bro. touched your spirit, bro. Oh, yeah. But, that bitch at Longhorns, you feel me? Yeah, so they go to Longhorns. I got to Texas Roadhouse. <clears throat> Longhorns is better, but shout out to you, bro. <laughs> uh, on my mama and that. On my mama and that. Longhorns On my mama and that. I argue about that. A thousand times better yeah, than Texas drunk, Roadhouse. Bro. See, niggas get gift cards and shit thrown at him. Now, nigga, y'all know I've been, I've been, a, I've been a Texas Roll House supporter from day one, bro. Don't ever do that. Them te- hey, them rolls. I got a bag of rolls at my crib right now. My motherfuckers no probably still right now. No, they ain't. That's they the best the thing. That's the best thing. That's the place where they crack the nuts on the ground and shit, right? A little dirty place. Texas <laughs> Roll House. Bro, what? Yeah. Nah, nigga, <laughs> don't ever disrespect Texas like that, bro. Hey, shout, out, shout out to the manager, bro. Shout out to Justin. I know shout if somebody to... offer you more money, you out of there. You nah, you lying. You to the soil anyway. Yeah, Elon, I know you loyal. So <laughs> Texas Roll House <laughs> Rolls or Old Charlie Rolls and they're prom? Oh, Charlie's. Texas, bro. Oh, Charlie's. Y'all niggas just smoking. Oh, Charlie. And the ambiance. I, I told you about that Whitney <laughs> shit. Listen, <laughs> I told you about that Whitney shit. Stay disrespecting her. <laughs> That's all the little dirty bitches you used said. to love going to the Texas Roadhouse, too. <laughs> nah, they all went to Old <laughs> nah, Charlie's. Nah. All the little rats <laughs> with the Old Charlie's, nah. bro. I was in there with They got some shit on they made you call Rattlesnake. The Rattlesnake, Rattlesnake Bites. bites. <laughs> <laughs> That's all that was in that motherfucker. <laughs> Those rattlesnakes, nigga. For <laughs> white town shit. Nigga. Fuck out of here. Everybody used to get that weak ass <laughs> potato salad from motherfucker like old Charlie's. This nigga said fries potato there. salad. What the shit was? Potato it? soup, nigga. Nigga, whatever had real french fries in there. I seen, I seen a nigga in the back cutting up french fries. I said, bitch, this is bullshit. 
Shit was trash. Texas Roadhouse menu is not fucking with Longhorns at all. Man, y'all niggas is drunk, bro. <laughs> Stop that's, playing. That's, that's very Shout out to my man that's Texas very Roadhouse. Well, no, nah, uh, shout out to you, bro. We, we fucking around, but appreciate that. Matter of fact, come to the Hendrick Experience, man. Nah, yeah, fuck with some, us. Bring some real you. food. Since oh, you, oh, shit. Since you saw it. <laughs> bring some real food to the Hendrick Experience. <laughs> Cause that motherfucker, oh, that, that motherfucker, motherfucker TV dinner, y'all keep got this thing. That's why he got gout down. Oh, I'm fucking with y'all. Oh, with that goddamn catfish out of here. He said he got gout. That's why he got gout oh, down. Oh, with that goddamn. <laughs> Yeah. Ain't that undone chicken breast? <laughs> My goddamn chicken wings was too fried up there. I'm, I'm that nigga just like, got chicken breast and lettuce. <laughs> <laughs> Trash ass salad. <laughs> but, Grow up, nigga. Get you some veggies, hey, nigga. Hey, man. Don't worry about what they talking about, man. Oh, man. That's a sick ass salad. That's crazy. Hey, man. Did y'all see Floyd Mayweather? <laughs> and uh, Haney Pops on the Instagram live arguing with each other? Yeah, that was Yeah, fun. bro. Haney got to leave the streets alone, bro. Leave the streets alone. Yeah, okay? well, you kept Bill talking Haney's about the streets, crazy, bro. Yeah, shit else to talk about, bro. I heard, I heard he about to leave him though. Is this son right? Uh, I, it'd probably be in his best interest if he did. Who yeah, leaving who? Devin. He probably can't, but he should. He doing what? <laughs> he probably can't leave Death Row, but he uh, probably so should. He doing what lines on them did? Yeah, but he keep talking about the streets, bro. He like the streets is, is gone, bro. You yeah. can't. I know you probably still get love in the streets, but, bro, there's no way you a street nigga still, bro. Yeah. And I'm sure Floyd looking out, bro. Floyd feeding the streets, bro. He he gave us a strip club, bro, in Vegas, bro. Yeah, He definitely facts. looked out for the streets, bro. Yeah. But Shout we, out to Floyd. What make it funny is the back and forth that Javante and Floyd had. <clears throat> he showed that video of Tank dancing and draw. Oh, that's hilarious. <laughs> that is crazy. I said, that's it. <laughs> <laughs> I said, man, they got this nigga out here. That's fucked up, man. Floyd. He said Floyd can't leave Dubai. Yeah. Say, oh, money, huh? That's fucked up, bro. That now, box, boxing yeah. beef is crazy. Pause. <laughs> like, that's crazy. <laughs> yeah. That was nuts. It's good for it's good for the sport, though. I mean, it make you want to. But I don't know. Don't nobody. Floyd don't fight no more, so it don't really matter. But yeah, I want to see Shakur and Tank fight, though, for sure. I don't think niggas really want to fight Javante. Um, I don't. I think they talk about it, but I don't think niggas really want to fight him. I mean, I would love to see that fight though. I think I think Shakur can. His defense is so good, but it'd be a boring ass fight because he don't really. He ain't really yeah. an action fighter like that. Tank, we'd be all be waiting for Tank to knock him out or some shit. But I thought Earl Spence and Crawford were supposed to do a rematch. What happened well, to that? Um, we, we want, man, we want Earl Spence to live. We yeah. don't want him to get well soon. He didn't have car wrecks, a Crawford wreck. We don't want. Him. <laughs> Damn. We don't want no more. Yeah. We want that nigga to live, man. Nah, he don't need that rematch. Mm-hmm. Third time was a charm, bro. Nah. <laughs> try to take him out. <laughs> you either kill Whitney. You yeah. try to kill Bobby. Now shout try shout to out to Mark Henry. Your nephew reached out. Fuck him, though. <laughs> <laughs> you still on the R.I.P. shirt, nigga. <laughs> right off of watching the show, nasty. <laughs> I'll fuck with you. I'll fuck with you. Hey, man. <laughs> I definitely fuck with you. That nigga killed Mark Henry so <laughs> many times. He killed him twice after we told him he was still okay. He was like, are we sure? I did it first, bro. Pause. Uh, Damn, Ray J. <laughs> <laughs> what else happened in the world? Hey, you know what I think is always funny about the NFL draft every single year? Fuck when they get picked or how they get picked. It's the family reactions and the people on Twitter live when they saw these reactions be hilarious. Shout out to old boy who got drafted, who had, he had the white girlfriend on the end. And his mama wasn't going. Hey. Oh, that was a Nigerian mama for sure. Yeah. I saw that Mumu with <laughs> the, uh, what do you call the outfit? What do they call them? The Sheikis. Yeah, she definitely had a Dada. <laughs> Mumu? Yeah. They called it the Dada. <laughs> Dada. Dada. Dada is crazy. They made Dada Supreme. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but she hit her with the swim move so hard. Like, boy, if you don't get that. That's so ball. uncomfortable, though. Just leave. You for you to be a white woman dating a nigga from Nigeria, you are a risk taker. <laughs> that's, that's a different type of black. That's a different type of black mama. For sure. How y'all feel about what Charles and White said about like uh NFL players and basketball players, whoever make it dating white women. It was like they smart because black women can't they go they worry about a nigga fucking. He said, "White women like, nah. Let's make sure these bills and everything taken care of. The white women worry about." Uh, I ain't rolling. Yeah, he's nuts. <laughs> he's wild. He is nuts. That's why I ain't rolling with that. 
Because this is black women. I don't know why athletes date white women. They love who you love. You feel me? A lot of y'all dating boys and shit now. <laughs> but black women are the most precious women in the world, bro. Are the most precious women in the world. So we're not going to take no slander on the black woman at all, bro. I can't, I can't really talk to this. Uh, so, I can't really. Make nah, it shout is. out to your love language. You feel me? It is what it is. Hold on, they make sure you but, clarify that. I just got a Spanish wife. <laughs> <laughs> it's level. <laughs> they make sure you. Nah, I'm just saying. Nah, it ain't you know, pee my nigga. But I'm just saying though. I don't think <clears throat> that these niggas. A lot of these people be going to the you know these white establishments, these white colleges, and sometimes they fed these women for real. Yeah, I was so, just, I just wondered what y'all thought about it. I thought, nah, it, was pretty, man, I thought it was pretty interesting, though. Scoop you up a black girl, man. Especially if you come from a good home, man. Every, every girl ain't a city girl. You feel me? Every black woman ain't no city girl. So I ain't I ain't nothing on that. Yeah, he's he's absolutely out of pocket for saying that. But I had to ask y'all a question. In that scenario, say it's your girl. You've been rocking with her, y'all cool. And it's beef right there. Say you really fuck with your girl. Have you ever been in a situation where you never had to argue for your girl against your, your, your mom? Nah, hell nah. My, nah. I'm standing on my mama. Yeah, my mama. I don't give a she fuck. She always be coming first anyway. Nah, I love Lady, though. Lady lady number one for sure. But it ain't even never going to ever get to that point where you into it with my mama. That's, nah. that's dead. So I, how that shit be going <clears throat> so far? Nah, I don't even. You can't even raise your voice at my mama. Because I'm going to check her before you. Just tell me what happened. Mm. And I'll go to her. But you ain't finna yell at my mama. I don't give a fuck. That's dead, bro. Yeah, my mama too. My mama too. Uh, my mama too street. That ain't going. Yeah. It ain't going to happen like that. Yeah. Like Carol T ain't going anyway. Yeah, just let so. me let me holler at my mama as I would do to you though. Unless me and your mama having a conversation, and I never get disrespectful, but just I holler at you like, hey, this mm-hmm. is feel me. At least holler at her for me. <clears throat> yeah. Get out of hand. Yeah. I asked that question because some people in the comments was just my first of all. They don't know how black households work. It was just like. Why wouldn't he say something to his mom about his girlfriend? Nigga, what? That ain't nigga, how those conversations nigga, we go. Made it. This, nigga, we made it. We fuck about her. We been here. Nigga, you about to, you know, you see Russell Wilson, girl? Hey. Who we went now? Hey, nigga, she ain't gonna make it. Updated roster. Yeah. That bitch look like Jim Carrey. That bitch he was dating in college. For sure he upgraded. Ain't none of these girls that's on that motherfucking screen with these niggas in the draft day gonna be there. Hey, shout it's out to the city. They about shout to go out. to this city. But you can't let your mama I violate your woman, though, because that kind of fuck up your career. But, you know. Fuck it. I'm 19. Violate. <laughs> she, ain't, she ain't down for the well, I mean, Yeah, but it, it depends, though, bro. How y'all rocking for real? You don't want your mama going too crazy on you. Bro, you know, yo, yo, all right, let's be real. Your white girl that you date in college week, now you about to get you a fire white girl. Oh, well, yeah, I ain't never dated no Hanes, too, so <laughs> I'm... For sure. I'm saying for the niggas who... You ain't never slid with a Taylor Swift? The Nigerian nah. person that was dating the uh, white yeah, girl. Yeah, Burner Boy is crazy for doing that. <laughs> but his new girl... <laughs> he where you got he to chose to play. <laughs> <laughs> he chose to play. I ain't even Burner Boy. <laughs> He chose to play with his mama like that, bro. Hey, if that nigga got drafted in that. Dallas, it's over with. I, my family blended. My daddy mixed, nigga. All my brothers, nigga, got white baby mamas for the most part, bro. So that's part of our family. You love who you love, but... And my mama always been respectful to everybody, even if they came into the relationship with kids. But you can't let a motherfucker go too crazy on your lady, though, bro. If you know your mama <laughs> clowning... <laughs> Yo, uh, mom, come on now. My mom's clowning. That's probably the best shot I done had. My mom's clowning. My mom's clowning. My mom's going ape shit. You know how Carol is. She clowning everybody coming yeah. in the factory. And you can come at her respectfully like, mom, come on now. I be saying shot. that. I be like, mom, I like her. Yeah. She like, boy, you like everybody. That's <laughs> 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 how my mama is. <laughs> boy, you like everybody. Oh. That's crazy. <laughs> Swear to God, it's not she. I remember when I was like 16, I used to date a girl. <clears throat> she told me flat out in front of her, in front of her boy, she ugly. I said, damn. I'll never forget that. Damn, don't say it. It was name. my first too. She said, she ugly. You don't like that girl? Boy, <laughs> she what's she doing? What's she doing for you? I said, no, mama. Boy having sex, she ugly. I said, damn. Asking what a 16-year-old is doing for you is crazy. Because she's just like, nigga, she is not attractive. <laughs> mom, you don't know she doing that Honda Accord after school. <laughs> You don't know she doing that hazmat. <laughs> that, that neck did her crazy, mama. 
Oh, wow. <laughs> like, mama, you don't understand. It's hard to replace, mama. The, the pregame is always there. There's not a lot of point guards. Or you just ask your mama, you either your friend or you got somebody better. Because I ain't giving up this <laughs> for nobody. Mama, you know, before the game, she give me together. We sleep in the car about this. <laughs> she give me together before the game, bro. Nigga said, I go to the transfer portal. Sleep in the car with your bitch. And your house is right there. It's crazy. Shout out to my little brother. I ain't going to mention your name, but I knew his bitch had a shot. His home is literally right here. My nigga slept in his whip with his bitch, bro. Oh, God. That's all my life. That's a true story. Swear to God, bro. Me and that her, nigga had back. leather seats, so he was sweating. <laughs> I said, that nigga Whoa. back was sticky as bitch. <laughs> I said, damn. Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm going to pull it up in the driveway. Motherfuckers passed out, laying on each other's shoulder. <laughs> like they on the airplane together. Man. Wait, there was in a driveway too? What? Oh, oh that's God. crazy. That's mm. a true story. <laughs> we can move on, though. That's crazy. Oh, man. Shout out to the NFL draft, man. I just laughed so hard. They were just like, why wouldn't he check his mom? That, y'all niggas are crazy. That ain't never how that go. Definitely not. Shout out to CP3, the real CP3 retired. Damn, CP gave it up? Yeah, man. Damn. Candace Parker done, man. Oh. Damn. I'm about to say, damn. I thought Golden State didn't reward my boy out. Oh, CP3, did. you talking about? Candace Parker, <laughs> Left-handed the guy. Uh, yes. Shout the Williams work. <laughs> Shonda Whip is a pioneer For sure They said her ankle was fucked up Right her foot <clears throat> Yeah I she thought it was her knee <clears throat> She was basically saying like She she wanted to be on her terms And she got tired of people Like every time she played Like she could be this Or she could be But she's just like I'm tired of having surgery I'm tired of going through all this And having nah, to be judged that. by this I feel that And I understood that For real, for real. When One you of see the greatest her, players ever When sure. you see her knees right now You can tell like Yeah She on her last leg When it came to hoop. Mm. Cause the motherfuckers rubbing together. Yeah. <laughs> when so, they start connecting at the patella, <laughs> when you start working the TNT, you just get Kenny Smith knees. <laughs> when your patellas rub, that's crazy. Yeah, spooky. <laughs> These your patellas. <laughs> when them rubbing, <laughs> shout out to she. Well, she she in the uh, if this is Mount Rushmore for women's basketball, she in there, motherfucker, ain't she? I give oh, it for to sure. her. Yeah, I'm. I'm Candace Parker's a ghost. As much as I fuck with CB, I swear to God, she was one of my favorite women's college. Oh, God, bro. Players. And I used to think she was pretty, bro. That Tennessee would pass some, and she was. She was one of the first girl who incredible. I thought was a trap. Yeah, she was. She was fun. And she was cold. Like, in the way she played basketball, yeah. the impact. Yeah, she's definitely. So, who y'all top? Who y'all rush more for the women's basketball? <laughs> no, but shout out to her, bitch. She had a hell of a career, bro. She oh, played shit. like 15, 16 years. Hell yeah. Now, she, she uh, for me, her, Maya Moore, definitely high up there. Y'all put Diana Taurasi up there. Mm-hmm. She she the next one. Diana Taurasi, it's time. Damn, y'all ain't fucking with uh Lisa Leslie, mm-hmm. Maya Moore. I said, yeah, I said Maya Moore and CP. Warren Jackson. Mine's a Cynthia Cooper, Candace Parker, uh, Diana Taurasi, and Got probably it. Sue Bird. Sue Bird. And then Maya, like, right there after them. She a little younger, though, but she, like, mm-hmm. ended it too early. Yeah, but she she did a lot of damage. Nah, she for sure was one of the guys. You know what? Who don't get a lot of love that she is in the news recently for the wrong reasons? Cheryl Swoops. What Swoops in the room? What's she doing now? Oh, she for just, hating on Caitlyn? Yeah. Yeah, uh, she, yeah after that, she did her that. Rant, yeah. Yeah. yeah, she would have her moments, but she was still one of the ones for sure. Yeah, she had her own sneaker and shit, though. That's hard. Yeah, that's... Yeah, that, that, you... Kaylin Back then, got, too, bro? Caitlyn got her own shit, too, though. Mm. <laughs> nah, <laughs> don't, 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 please don't get us... I don't know why people are still mad about that, dog. Yeah, people told me I was Uncle Tom. I said, damn. <laughs> I said, for damn. I didn't say she was that good. What made it funny is people were just like, y'all, they're paying her. I said, for who? They're like, y'all want her on the show. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> y'all, y'all think y'all about to we see do, Kelly? but I... Y'all think y'all about to see Kelly Clark up here? Though, Kelly bro, Clark is kinda... not walking in this studio. No, no yeah, she's nah. not. Hell no. Nah. So y'all think yeah. we just like good basketball. She yeah, not. that's what I'm saying. She cold, bro. If she ever come to this motherfucker, that'd be crazy. Like, yeah, I'd be hype as fuck. We reach new heights, but yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, trust me, we are not on that media press run. Nope. I wish. Uh, we got to clean it up. Patella. <laughs> oh, I can't wait to drop that, bitch. That's a tweet. Hey, um, this made me think of you. Tank Dale was out in the club. Unfortunately, he was in to buy Sanders some, some gun spray. And it made me think about your Miami trip. 
Oh, yeah. So, yeah, my cousin, uh, she danced at um, Booby Trap. <clears throat> and, uh, we went to the club one day. I was meeting them up there. Really Your cousin of, danced at Booby Trap? Yeah. Really out of pocket for going, but that was with the family. I wanted to show the family a good time. My people's from that. You okay. went to watch your cousin dance? Yeah. <laughs> no Kevin Gates, but... Incest is crazy. <laughs> nah, nah, I never cracked her. <laughs> it was, I wasn't nothing on that. Anyway, nigga, you out of pocket. <laughs> I was really just, it was nowhere to go. I was the tourist in Miami. But anyway, we went there. Niggas got the dumping at the door. Nigga shot at me. <laughs> Motherfucker bullet went through my polo, nigga. Swear God, to God. Damn. I flew in the bushes, nigga. This is how fucked up I am. Bullet holes all in the door. They keep the club open, nigga. And I, I go in the club and finish my night, nigga. <laughs> wow, time. That's crazy you remember that shit. <laughs> the the polos had the bullet hole. <laughs> yeah, shout out to Cuz. You know, I right don't show my people a Man, good what's, time. What's a King Von homeboy that got shot in the head? Damn, what's hold up? on. I didn't yeah. leave to me. <laughs> yeah, because that's... You already seen that? Uh, nah, he's still alive. <laughs> Damn, nigga, it missed. I know, that's how he feel. <laughs> that's how, that he ain't feel. how he feel. Nigga. He probably like, nigga, that was reading at the draft. <laughs> he just did an interview with Vlad. That's why I'm saying that. Shout out to that man. I don't want no smoke, bro. Because shit, obviously, you got some shit, some super and shit. <laughs> So I'm cool. That nigga, they said that nigga was Meteor Man or some shit. So I'm cool. They call a nigga Blank Man. I said, hey, I bet you a lot. Quit playing with people. I told Nibby, hey, I appreciate your effort. Stop playing with Bobby Porters. <laughs> Niggas on the internet have guns too. Leave yeah, them alone. Yeah, that nigga. But anyway, y'all ain't see that nigga though? He got yeah. shot like he half his head missing? No. Nah. Compare that nigga to me, you a fucked up nigga. <laughs> My fault, bro. Part in the club with the so bullet I, hole. In the I, hole seen him on, I seen him in black, but you going back in the club with a bullet hole in your shirt is crazy. It's a good time, bro. That's what I mean. Only for the fam, bro. OTF. <laughs> See? See? That's what I said. I'm not. Before we get out of here, <clears throat> you should suck them do it. I'll pop it. Bro, shit crazy, though. I, I tried. I couldn't find it. Nah, bro, that shit crazy, bro. He, just look at King Von homeboy with half his head. Von friend shot the head. I could find This homeboy, he got That's shot at the same time that Von got killed. <laughs> he doing a black, he just did a black interview. Like. interview. He be wearing hats to cover up his shit, though. <clears throat> did y'all see allegedly Stephen A. Smith uh, called the Players Union <laughs> about Russell Westbrook? What? What'd he say? By his behavior. His name is Oblock Lloyd. Yeah. Oblock Lloyd. Louis. Yeah, Wilson, Lloyd. Oblock Lloyd. For sure. Yeah, gangster. What? No, no, no. Hold on. Hold on before we get out here. Stephen A. Smith said what? Mm. Viagra. He called the Viagra on who? What? Whoa. No, I said called the Players Union about Russell Man, Westbrook. this nigga always on some <laughs> freaky time, bro. He, I thought he, he ate said. one honey pack. Now all he can think about is Viagra, bro. <laughs> why, he called, many. why he called that? Oh. I, I don't know how to respond after that. <laughs> I don't know what he on, I'm but confused. what he called the players? Blue Chew, tap in. <laughs> We're not getting that. Hold on. I'm pulling it up. I can't swallow the pill, so make sure it's dissolvable. <laughs> <coughs> One of the sickest. Basically, that swing that he had to Josh Green in game three, mm. basically, he was just like, it's unexcusable why he didn't get kicked out for that. And what mm. kind of fish shit he on? And that's, what, and that's what Jalen Rose was just like. I'm so happy. I'm comfortable with my skin. I ain't got to do all this weird ass shit. He's like, what type of bullshit is that? They basically yeah. was calling him Uncle Tom. Nah, facts, bro. That shit. Hell yeah. That's fair as hell. Calling the players union to get a nigga suspended is crazy. He ain't really do that. Hey, man. We he gonna, so yeah, we gonna spare him with that one. I ain't gonna say We ain't gonna put that on. I ain't gonna say he did that, but if he did that, that that's fair as hell. Like, why you care that much? Exactly. What type of whole ass shit is that? Yeah. Now, that's one thing about these players I will say. I think that's been really weird. I know that a lot of the tiggy tack shit get called now. They over dramatic shit and making more shit than they has to. But when I play out basketball, niggas be getting hit, bro. Niggas be getting. Now, Joe and B got away with a lot of bullshit. Cause oh, that, yeah. that leg pull on Mr. Robinson, Robinson was Robinson dirty was, as fuck, bro. That was out of pocket, yeah. bro. Yeah. Yeah. That, like, that nigga really got hurt, bro. That shit was dirty as fuck. He, but old school playoff basketball, niggas got knocked the fuck nah, out. He, probably, he was supposed to get kicked out, bro. I oh, ain't gonna a, hold you, bro. That was, that no, was, that was filthy. He should have been. That was out of pocket, bro. Yeah, that was nasty. But some of the shit they've been playing, like, this series is grimy as is, but I'm like, they letting a lot of shit just yeah. normally regular-ass fouls, and they dramatic, like, 
Pat Bev getting a too small tech, that's crazy, bro. Yeah. That's basketball. He got when he get that tech today. He got yeah. I was about to say, I know he ain't do it that one game. All right, nah, because he got that, uh, the father stretched my hands, highlight, yeah. belt the ass tour. <laughs> put that on the, put that on the reel. Bucks and seven, bro. What the fuck are you talking about? Pat Bev, tap in, bro. Bucks and seven. Hey, right, we're going to need you to score, <clears throat> though, my boy. Hey, my boy, you going to have to shoot some shots now? He hurt. Who, Pat Bev yeah. hurt, too? Nah, hurt. bro, fuck that. Everybody out there, bro, who? What's wrong with him? His wrist is fucked up. He probably should have surgery. Oh yeah, yeah, he, <clears> yeah. He, 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 fuck it, you out there? You got to, you got to get some buckets, my they boy. They need you, P. Yeah, you got to shoot you, that bro. rock, bro. All I'm saying is, I saw the father stretch my hands. Tyrese game winner highlights, bro. Bucks and seven, bro. Y'all Pat playing Bear. a depleted team, though. Pat we Bear. beat them with and without. I'm I don't need you. Don't I'm need you to get like 20, 25. Oh shit, you'll be getting season tickets before you do that. <laughs> nah, Pat. <laughs> Go crazy, Fuck, fuck what he talking about. Fuck Bucks what he talking about, Pat. Bucks and seven, Wrong, man. turn him up, bro. Facts, you bro. You fuck with the show, bro. Shout turn out to y'all, good, man. Bro. Slide through. Y'all, y'all see it's about to be over. I have some free time. Wow. Bucks and seven. We go open availability. Bucks and seven. All right, but man. Shout with to that being Pacers, said, bro, man. Bro. Let's get the fuck out I of here. I play for the Pacers, too, so. <laughs> Why you in Brene Jersey? I lost it. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck. Be here and tell the people they can get some merch, man. Shop club520.com, please, for your latest merch, baby. For sure, you know what it is. Like, share, subscribe, all that good shit. We'll be back next time, Club 520.